everybody, Jesse Slot City Fishing. I'm uh, building out this 2013 Hobie Pro Angler 12 and I just finished my camera setup uh, for a rail for a gear track mount. Uh, I was using the Scotty mount before, but I just made this uh, from a little monopod and then a bunch of random connectors. And uh, there's a video out there that's very similar to this but the guy has to use a hacksaw and actually cut it and then like JB weld in the little parts and stuff. But this particular monopod from Manfrotto already had the right size threaded screws and everything. So going from this, no like, you know, telescoping or anything like that to now I can boom this thing out like four feet off from my kayak. I mean, and then you can see like the camera angle potential is way crazier. But anyway, uh, this is super easy to make. Uh, legit, the parts just screw into each other and right off the shelf. You don't gotta do any like fabrication or anything like that. So uh, make this video short and sweet. Uh, here's how you do it. All right, let me show you what you need, how you put this thing together. So this is the actual boom itself, Manfrotto Compact Extreme 2-in-1 Multipole. And I got it on sale, 30 bucks. All right, next up, you're gonna take that guy out of the package. The reason this works so good is right here. For some reason, they got a, a screw with thread on the bottom. All right, then next up, you got your Yak Attack screw balls. It's a one inch screwball uh, for a gear track. You're gonna discard this one. Put it on there. Get it as tight as you can. There you go. Now you got uh, this piece is a ram three inch double socket arm for one inch balls. I don't know if you can see that. I'm gonna put links for all this stuff in the description. And look at how easy this, this is. Put that in there, put that in there, and just tighten this guy down. Uh, this monopod came with a GoPro mount, so just screw that on. It has a ball socket on here, so you can move this any, any direction that you want to. Now we have this little setup right here. So you got your three inch connector, your two screw balls. It screws into the bottom of the monopod. This is just a paracord wrap I did to match my kayak. Then here's your telescoping arms and it booms out to like four feet. And now you just need gear track. And most uh, kayaks nowadays come with gear track. If not, gear track is super, cheap and very very easy to install so now you can see that'll slide onto a gear track and it's good to go and i'm fairly confident that this is the absolute best easiest way to get a super high quality boom so there you go super easy i think all in all i have like 45 bucks in this but the at the kayak retailers i think the railblazer makes a gopro mount but none of them do the telescoping like they're they're short and you know the thing with this one is it's, it's versatile so with these screw balls you can mount it like any position like i plan on doing some like boom shots where i put this really far out and then put it in the water and then like release fish over the camera you know you wouldn't be able to do that with any of like the store-bought ones uh, but yeah I think it turned out pretty epic 
and it's easy to do. All right, if you liked uh, this do-it-yourself video, I got lots of other content like this on my channel and we're always adding new stuff, but mainly we're a, a kayak fishing channel, so that's the majority of, uh, of my stuff is actually going out there and catching fish, but I get the most views on this kind of stuff, like thousands, so I hope that this helps you. Uh, if it did, you know, shoot us a like and uh, subscribe to the channel. I'm building out this uh, 2013 PA-12 right now and it's coming out sick, so uh, be on the lookout for that video. But anyway, thanks for watching and uh, tight line. See you guys on the water.